Hi all, I don't know whether how clearly you can see the entrance to our new building. Um, this is the car park going in, there's uh, all kinds of stuff happening at the moment. Now these works are going to take three weeks, which means that for the next three Sundays you're not going to be able to use this car park. Um, so make sure you get here on time if you want to park somewhere. Uh, but it's good to see and in time we're going to get a sign up, uh, hang on, there, um, which will have uh, Safe Centre, um, short for um, the Southern Adelaide Family Enrichment Centre, which is also going to be up there. And it's been interesting, uh, the leadership team, we've been chatting a little bit about what our hopes and plans are, and we've, we've taken huge steps as a church community over the past few years about being a place of welcome. We actually want to take the next step forward as well and we're aware that a lot of people going into churches um, don't know what welcome means does it mean they're going to be tolerated does it mean that people are going to be accepted with everything does it what actually does it mean um, and also it is a bit of a lottery because different churches mean different things themselves by oh well you're welcome to come here uh, welcome to what welcome to attend welcome to uh, join in the ministry welcome to join the leadership team what does welcome mean so over the next uh, season we're going to be really praying and uh, seeking God together and we're going to be uh, really trying to put that down in writing about what welcome means at this church and also what it means to journey together in a lot more detail. Uh, we're going to keep obviously our statement of faith about what we believe, that's very clear, we're not changing anything, we, we believe what we believe and uh, that's, um, that's uh, there for all to see. But the way our posture towards the community, uh, to be honest, needs to change even further than it has already. We. Um, we, we want to be a place where we are authentic, where we are true, where there is no gap between what we say we mean and uh, you know, you've heard us talk about minding the gap and this is a, another gap we just want to be really clear on so that uh, anybody who comes to Christie's Beach Baptist Church is very clear on uh, our story, on who we are and on um, what it, it means to journey with us. But it also means us taking a place of humility as well and possibly taking some risks uh, and uh, just as Jesus did and hopefully we will get to a, on a journey together. We want to welcome people uh, onto the journey that we are on. We are all people who continually make mistakes. Our thought lives are often a mess. Our mental health is often a mess. Lots of things are often a mess. Um, so why should we exclude people who um, we don't always see eye to eye, eye with as well. We want them on the journey with us. We want to be able to go on that journey and to live in this place, as Julie's been talking about, this liminal space that we are sometimes in, where we're just working through together what it is that we believe. So as I say, we're not talking, please do not hear that we're talking about changing theology or changing anything like that. We're absolutely not. This is about our posture towards the community and it's about how we journey together and uh, genuinely how we welcome people. We want people to feel here like they are our, lit, literally our brother and sister, that they we will not reject them, that they are on a journey with us and they are welcome to attend uh, with us on that journey together. So I hope you're getting that. We will put, be putting something out. It's so important to us. We will be taking it to a member, the membership for all of you to consider, prayerfully consider, make sure you're all happy uh, with it. And uh, you know we'll be doing that towards uh, the end of the year. Anyway, for now, remember, church on Sunday, get down here in time, uh, Mother's Day on Sunday, get down here in time, one, because I think there may be some things waiting for you at the door, and secondly, because you're gonna need to find a parking space. All right, guys, God bless, take care.